one today I'll be discussing um, Mamaru whether it's required not required um, how it works with the baby how it helped me basically uh, and also I'll be discussing this against uh, a swing Greco Greco swing what, what works best and uh, every every aspect of it so what I would suggest is if you're planning to buy this you need to buy it really beforehand um, you need to buy before actually the baby is born because this is the baby is going to grow out of this really really quick um, um, so my baby as you can see she's already had her legs are out of it uh, she's about four months old um, but I it re really did help me in the beginning uh, when she was really tiny and um, you know she had a little bit of um, a problem with you know digesting uh, milk and things like that she used to spit up uh, so I wouldn't lay her flat after she's done feeding once she's uh, sleeping she's fed and she's sleeping uh, rather than la la laying her flat on the bed I would lay her in this um, until she gets good sound sleep for about half an hour and then remove her from there um, so that would help um, her in uh, settling her milk down and then she would sleep for longer hours later when she's out of there so it helped so the colic is what they say um, if your baby has a colic problem uh, it can help but you cannot put a crying baby and expect this thing to soothe the baby that is not going to happen um, once the baby has settled down she's sleeping rather than you know if you if your baby has a colic problem uh, then she will wake up again crying if you like lay her flat but if you lay her in this she will continue to sleep for a longer period so that's how this has helped me when she was really tiny and swings are not recommended when the ba your baby is really tiny because it's too much for a really tiny baby to swing across so this is really uh, the motion is really smooth um, so it's not very um, tiring for a newborn baby so that way you know it still helps you um, so it has basic settings and the audio in this is not very good uh, and even the audio options are just a heartbeat and a vo vo uh, noise a white noise right. so you can see the white noise and then you can push the button in the middle to change the noise So that's the heartbeat. Not sure if um, this camera captures it, the noise. But no, it's not very good, the sound system. I never really used it. I always used music on my laptop uh, to soothe her. Um, so it was, um, music is just a waste on this one. Um, but there are other, um, there are four kind of motions in here. Uh, the one that I used the most is the tree swing um, so this is not very heavy for the newborn baby and all it does is swing right to left, left to right and uh, yeah, it turns that so that, that is the motion it gives yeah. so you can adjust the speed as well so this one was the one I used the most when she was sleeping. Uh, the the toy bar there, um, removable, um, so it really helps when the baby wakes up. If the toy bar is not there, like I thought, you know, this might disturb her, and I used to just slide her, slide it across. If it is not there, as soon as she wakes up, she would feel lost and she would start crying. But if the toy toy bar is there, even if she wakes up, she sees that and she goes back to sleep. Um, so that really helped. Um, yeah, that's about it. But downsides uh, to it is, you know, it, the, your baby grows out of it really fast. Um, probably three months is max um, that you can use it. And it doesn't doesn't come with a newborn uh, attachment. Uh, I had to buy this attachment um, separately. Uh, but it. It's not very well made for some reason uh, but this comes as a separate attachment 
um, and even with this attachment your newborn baby there's not uh, there's no proper head support to it so that's something that you will have to think about um, it's really important that baby get, gets head support we, we used to um, give additional pillows uh, the neck and try to give her additional support um, that's again a downside um, to it uh, if I would not say uh, Mamaru as a must-have it's a nice to have um, but um, it's a nice to have for first three months where you know your baby is not ready to swing um, this one gives a nice nice moment so she, your baby sleeps for a longer time and it's also inclined so you can incline the various positions that you can incline this uh, but I always used the most inclined position that's how it helped her when, whenever she had colic problem mm, but yeah it, I didn't buy it for the first month I should have um, but once I bought it even helped me for about two months even though that, that help was um, if, if you're handling the baby all alone by yourself um, I, I feel that you know I would recommend you know you just go ahead and buy this before she's actually born that will help you a lot even to just put her um, on it and go take a bath while she's sleeping or go get a cup of tea or something like that I would put her there I would lock her up and uh, I know she's safe she's sleeping for some time um, so that really helped um, but now I don't I can't leave her in in here uh, anywhere um, so I don't actually use it now these days so once she was three months old um, you know I had we had to buy this swing uh, Greco this is a lifesaver really uh, what it does is it actually sleep trained my baby uh, like you know I used to put her in this like 10 in the morning 2 in the afternoon and 7 in the evening I did it for about two three days and my baby started sleeping on her own uh, on, the, on that particular time uh, 2 and 2 10 and 7 so this actually sleep trained so all all you have to do is just put it on and they will they will keep seeing the bears and um, she used to um, drift off to sleep and sleep till the swing is on she used to sleep continuously two three hours um, I had to just so that to feed her I had to switch off the swing so that she could wake up and I could feed her so that is um, this Greco uh, baby she still fits in it and um, so this newborn um, attachment comes with it so I had I have to remove this now because she's quite old enough so she can sit on it without it let's just remove it right so once we remove it this comes like that and the music on this is not great either it's really really loud you cannot put that on and sleep it's really loud for the baby's ears too and um, so I would not recommend the music on either of them uh, but this one um, you know you can turn this to your left to your right so you turn to your left and swing and you can turn this to your right and swing All right so this one, it, it swings automatically it has six speed settings so all you have to just switch it on and it just keeps swinging and your baby drifts off to sleep really quick in this um, so obviously don't try to put the baby in here while uh, she's crying or anything soothe her first and when she's calm just put her there and then switch on the swing and she'll drift off to sleep like in two three minutes um, so that has to be a happy place for them don't try to put put them in there and lock them up when they're crying so that it becomes their sad prison uh, place so that should not be the case so always what we did was if the baby is crying we try to soothe them first and then once they're calm then try to put them in there and then you know 
uh, swing it so this really helped me with my sleep um, I was really struggling with the sleep initially uh, but once I bought this then you know she's sleeping on time I'm sleeping on time and uh, it has really helped both of us get good sleep so I would say this is a must-have if you don't have budget for both of these um, the Greco um, I've linked the um, link it down below in the description uh, I'm not sure which model is this but you know this is the best model of, of what they offer so um, if you don't have budget for the Greco swing and the Mamoru what I would say is skip the Mamoru get the swing because this is going to last you for a long time it is much much helpful in you know putting down the baby to sleep than the Mamoru um, so what I would say is uh, buy this um, Greco swing but if you have budget for both you have um, then I would recommend you know first three months initially use the Mamoru uh, it's better for the baby it's not going to spin her head um, and then after three months you can use the Greco um, so you know good if the baby sleeps well you know she's obviously happy you can see a happy baby there <laughs> she's always smiling and she's always happy so that's a good sign um, so that's all you guys that's the uh, that's what I wanted to talk about um, if you want me to get into details of this just uh, uh, details uh, of functionality of the Greco all it, it has it has this music if you want me to play I can play as well so you can see it's quite loud even even this lowest sound is quite loud so you can switch off the sound if you don't want that's what we generally do we don't want it so we go and mute and then you can lock it uh, so if you want to put the baby and you don't want the swing to swing so you can lock the swing as well so by pushing this button so once your baby is asleep, probably if you want the swing to hold, and then you can just put it in lock position, and then you know that's it. So these these bears are really helpful as well. So she loves these bears. Um, so what I do generally, if she's trying to reach out to them, I just take one out of one out from here and give it to her, so she holds that and she goes to sleep as well. Um, so that's been helpful. that's about it okay my baby is calling me now so i'll have to rush to her so see you guys in the next video